Hello guys. Hi everyone. And uh, this is uh, really the new idea and I'm going to show you how to do the great circle sailing formula. Like uh, how to do it in Havasan method. It's a lot of people are preparing for the second mates after finishing their cadet ship 18 months sea service. So this really helpful for them. Alternative month they are having their written exam. So let me go on what is great circle sailing. Great circle sailing we use it for the longest distance and uh, it has to be more than 600 nautical miles. If it is less than 600 nautical miles, we have to use a normal plane sailing. And uh, because shorter distance, you draw a straight line on a marketer chart, the run line will be on a straight line, will be looking a straight line and it cuts all the meridians at right angle. So you don't want to alter the course, just two or three waypoints straight line, you can maneuver the ship. If it is longer, more than 600 nautical miles because great circle will be curved on a marketer chart so it will be cutting all the meridians at different angles and uh, this is the normal concept i'll go quick on to the sums so this will be the sum i'm going to show you how to do it in have a sign method so this three 32 degree 12 minutes and this is the question 0818 degree 15 minutes west to b 0540 minutes north, 034 degree, 20 minutes east. I'm going to tell you how to draw the vector first before drawing the diagram. It's very simple. And check first the latitude 32 degree, 05 degree. 32 is stop and 05 is down. So you draw the vector is going down, first vector. And check next line is longitude 018 west, 034 east. Just take the first two things, that's enough. So 018 west is on this side, it's going on the left to right direction, 034 degree east. So vector on this side. So there is a relative vector is this side. So show the ship is sailing on this direction, you're able to draw the diagram. And one more thing, just check whichever is the closest pole. So you take that pole and draw the diagram, okay? Because this is 32 degree 12 minutes north, Everything both are on the same hemisphere. So I'm going to take the north port. So this will be the diagram and you draw the vector and ship A, B. It's going from here and uh, draw the name A dash opposite of this B dash, P dash, whatever name you're giving. And this is my initial and this is my final. I'm going to find it in have a sign formula. So have theta is equal to one minus cos theta by two. Only this you just remember. And uh, first, I'm going to find the distance. Distance means how P dash from A to B, the ship has gone and this will be the, my distance. So I'm going to find it using have a same formula. So how P, first you take this how P, this angle, how P equal to opposite of that angle, how P dash minus the difference of the adjacent angle. If you're taking this P as an angle and this will be the adjacent. So minus have the difference of that. Don't mention if it is negative sign is coming. It's not that. The difference of this 84 degree 20 minutes minus 57 degree 48 minutes. And divided by sine adjacent. Same sine 84 degree 20 minutes sine 57 degree 48 minutes. Then after that I need have P dash remaining and I will know. So I'll take it on this side. Just I'll simplify. So I am converting this how P will be coming on this direction. So I will change it in 1 minus cos 52 degree 35 minutes by 2. That is my half P into this is going on this direction into sine 84 degree 20 minutes into sine 57 degree 48 minutes. Plus this is going on this direction. So it's plus 1 minus cos 26 32 minutes divided by 2. After simplifying with the scientific calculator and one more thing. Don't put it on the scientific calculator. Use directly like one minus cos this value divided by two. Answer will be wrong. First find out your cos 52 degree 35 minutes first. Then with that answer, one minus this answer, then divided by two. So you write nine digit after decimal nine digit. So your value will be perfect, accurate. So I'm gonna simplify this on the scientific calculator. I got this value. 0.69 for this simplifying and sine 84 degree 20 minutes into this I got this value 
plus 1 minus cos 26 degree 32 minutes divided by 2 I got this value on the scientific calculator after simplifying I got 0 0.638900545 then this is also 1 minus cos p dash divided by 2 so this 2 will be going on this direction after simplifying you need to find only the p dash after further simplifying with the basic max I got p dash equal to 106 degree 7 minutes and that you convert it into miles it means it is on degree into 60 into 60 will be your distance that is 6367 miles so writing here write it in an angle so I found this angle p dash the distance of p dash we found using the Haversine formula next I'm going to explain how to find the initial course for angle a I'm going to tell you how to find the initial course same have a same formula I'm going to use it to find the initial course to find this angle a so I'll tell you same so I'm going to find it on have a equal to opposite of this angle have a dash minus the difference of this b dash and p dash 106 degree 0 7 minutes minus 57 degree 1 8 minutes so have a I'll keep it on that side so same thing I'm gonna find use the have theta equal to 1 minus cos theta by 2 you know that so I will transfer this 1 minus cos what is a dash is 84 degree 20 minutes divided by 2 1 minus the difference of that is cos 48 degree 19 minutes divided by 2 divided by sine of this adjacent sine 57 degree 48 minutes and sine 106 degree 07 minutes you practice it for two or three sums guy I believe you, you it is really easy for you you don't want to memorize this formula and I'm telling you it's very simple and after simplifying on your scientific calculator on this one cos 84 degree 20 minutes first then answer 1 minus this answer divided by 2 I got this value 0 0.4506295983 always write 9 digit after the decimal same thing after simplifying this I got this value 0 0.167493430 divided by multiplying this to sine 106 degree into sine 57 degree 48 minutes I got this 0 0.8129364590 so after further simplification I got this value 0 0.348288171 and uh, this side same change have theta 1 minus cos a divided by 2 so this 1 minus cos a I'll keep it on this side this 2 will go up so 2 into this I got this 0 0.6965 then finally cos a equal to 1 minus of this answer a equal to cos inverse of that answer you can get it on the scientific calculator you got angle a equal to 72 degree 20 minutes and always remember I'll tell you the nearest angle to your ship's head that is your initial course the ship is going from west to east direction so this angle will be same nearest longitude this is my nearest longitude and this is my ship's head so 72 degree 20 minutes this is my initial course initial course 72 degree 20 minutes so if the ship is going B to A direction the ship is going B to A direction I'll tell you like this if it is going like this and uh, your nearest longitude to your ship's head will be your initial course fine so this will be nearest longitude to your ship's head figure out inside angle you know that 180 minus this will be your initial course always understand nearest longitude to your ship's head Phew. next time I'm gonna explain you how to find the final course angle B same have a sign formula I'll use it have B opposite of that angle have B equal to have B dash minus adjacent of this have difference of these two 106 degree 07 minutes minus 84 degree 20 minutes divided by same use the sign 
साइन वन जीरो सिक्स डिग्री जीरो सेवन मिनट्स साइन एटी फोर डिग्री ट्वेंटी मिनट्स आफ्टर फर्दर सिंप्लीफिकेशन विल गेट हैव बी डैश वैल्यू सब्सिट्यूट द वैल्यू बी डैश इज फिफ्टी सेवन डिग्री फोर्टी एट मिनट्स एंड दिस इज द डिफरेंस देन आफ्टर आई यूज हैव टीटा फॉर्मूला वन माइनस कॉस टीटा बाई टू सो दिस विल बी वन माइनस कॉस फिफ्टी सेवन डिग्री फोर्टी एट मिनट्स डिवाइडेड बाई टू माइनस सिंप्लीफाई दिस वन माइनस कॉस ट्वेंटी वन डिग्री फोर्टी सेवन मिनट्स डिवाइडेड बाई टू डिवाइडेड बाई साइन वन जीरो सिक्स इन टू साइन एट्टी फोर डिग्री आई कॉट दिस वैल्यू ऑन द साइंटिफिक कैलकुलेटर पुट इट ऑन सो इट्स लाइक अ सिंप्लीफिकेशन आई एम एक्सप्लेन यू गैस यू कैन डू इट ऑन योर ओन वे विच एवर इज ईजियर सो आई सिंप्लीफाई लाइक दिस ओनली equal to cos 57 degree 48 minutes first i will find the value then 1 minus cos this answer divided by 2 i got this value same you do it for this one you got this value divided by 0.956 then this one you simplify 1 minus cos divided by 2 after simplification you got this value 0.196215 So this will be pretty easier. Same as what we did. Have a sign is always same. It's very simpler. And uh, cos one minus cos be equal to two will go on this side. Two into this multiplying by this value into two. I got this value. Cos be equal to then cos be will go on this side. One minus zero point three nine two four three one three four nine. So be equal to cos inverse of this value. I got fifty two degree thirty six minutes. so here you should remember what is your initial or final course nearest longitude to your ship's head measured clockwise see for final initial course nearest longitude to your ship's head clockwise direction that is your initial course here i got this inside angle 52 degree 36 minutes but i this is my final course nearest to longitude to the ship's head measured clockwise direction so this will be 180 degree 180 minus 52 degree 36 minutes i will get this value that is my final course so final course equal to 180 minus 52 degree 36 minutes and that's going to be my final course i'm going to calculate it guys 180 degree minus 52 36 my final course equal to 127 degree 24 minutes this is my final course only two things you have to remember while drawing this diagram just know the vector how to draw it and what i explained you in the beginning then after that you have to take the nearest pole either north or south pole here both the one is the northern hemisphere so i took it on the north pole fine the next nearest longitude to the ship's head measured clockwise direction that is your initial or final course only three things keep it on your mind thank you